Hey, hello everybody, this is Chilbill, and today I'm bringing you Farming Simulator 17, a tutorial on how to put mods on your server. Now, I, I, I did receive a few requests to uh, to make this, so I thought I'd go ahead and do that for you. Uh, I've got my server sitting here. This is the GUI that we logged into on the first video of how to set up your dedicated server. This is how to put the mods on there. Uh, so you open your GUI, everything's there. You got to make sure your server stopped, and uh, you go to mods, and you find the the uh, mod that you want to download uh, if Giants makes it. If Giants doesn't make it, then you have to download the mod to your to your computer, and then browse for the file, and upload it to the server GUI. And that's that's pretty much the long and short of that. I'll do a separate video concerning outside mods when there's a mod worth downloading. So uh, the two mods that I'm putting on the server are the tire dirt and the ground response uh, mods. So this is the four reel mod, the zero two and zero three. So I'm going to download both of those by clicking on the download icon out next to it just like that. Okay. Uh, and now once I've done that I go to home go down to the bottom you see these two are here uh, they're not activated okay so I had to check the boxes next to them and then I press activate and that'll put on active mods okay I start the server just like normal and in order for you to play on that server now you must have those two mods installed on your local machine okay so that the machine that you were planning on playing with so I open up my steam I press my OK button it starts up my server and I should be good to go. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll have another tutorial video out for you later on. Um, I appreciate you guys. See you next time.